Gary, congratulations first of all then on your man of the match. That was a tough slog today. Yeah, I don't think people probably realised the conditions were quite tough. It was a strong blaze out there. Scrappy game, which which it is in this league, you know, and to come out on top in a game like that, it's always a good sign. Is that more or less what you expected from, from St Mirren to play? They were really quick on the counter. Yeah, I think most teams are. We've done it a lot last year, uh, so teams are probably trying to sit in and do a little bit to us, but we didn't give away too many chances. Yeah, they're going to get a chance in this game. These games, you're not going to dominate for 90 minutes against anyone, no matter who you're playing home and away. So, yeah, you might ride a bit of luck, but we've kept clean sheets in a lot of games now, and sometimes it does take just the one goal to win it, and if you stay in the game and keep the back door shut, you've always got a chance. Talking of the back door, obviously um, Stuart Finlay goes off. The manager's kind of given us an update on on what that is. But Alex Bruce came in and just showed exactly what he's all about. The, the proper professionals. He slotted in there as if he's been playing each week. Yeah, I think he's probably been unlucky to be fair to him. When he, whenever he's played since I've been here, I don't think he's had a bad game. Hasn't conceded many goals when he's playing. I think if you look at the stats, he's had a hell of a lot of clean sheets when he's played. So definitely, and you look at Burkey on the bench as well. You've got players there that probably feel unfortunate not to be playing and they come on and they put in performances like that so I think it's great for us and probably teams are looking at us we probably have been quite fortunate with injuries probably got one of the better injury records in the league so we'll regroup as I said we've got enough players there looking to come in as well on Wednesday Yeah it's going to be a tough game away to, to Motherwell on Wednesday night Yeah definitely they're flying at the moment to be fair they've had some good results and they've picked up over the last probably six or seven months they've, they've turned the corner and Started to play a different style of football that they probably haven't playing. Um, it'll be a tough game. We won't be going in there thinking it's going to be an easy game. I'll give you that. I want to quickly touch on the fact that we've, we seem to be scoring goals now from all around the pitch. You've now got yourself up to two for the season, uh, which is, from your perspective, brilliant. But the goals just seem to come all over. Yeah, I think Steve Clark was playing me in the wrong position, to be honest with you. Killing me. Um, nah, listen, I'm, I'm happy to score. As you know, I'm, I'm one of them players. It doesn't bother me who scores the goals or where they come from once the team wins. And that's the most important thing, picking up three points, because it makes a massive difference in this league, even as a few draws and stuff like that. So they get the three points. And I know there's games to come tomorrow, but we want to be looking up the table. But as I said, we're not getting ahead of ourselves. It's a tight league and two results can drag you back down. Well, it's three wins on the bounce now. And that, it was always going to be a big test for us today, but that shows a lot of character. Yeah. I think I touched on it earlier up there. We've got great characters in the dressing room. Obviously, yeah, we, we had a horrible start, which we didn't want, but we know what's in that dressing room. We've got some good characters, like just Stu, Berkey, Brucey, Al Power, uh, boys that have been here the last two years, and we didn't panic. I know everyone else panicked, but we know what we're doing in there. Maybe it did take us a bit of time to bed into what we're doing, but I think it's more or less the same as we've been doing the last two years now. I think you can see we're being solid, and hard to beat and we'll always get a chance and finally the one thing I, we spoke about it off camera everyone has been asking a big question when you scored last week who were you pointing at over at the uh, at the control room obviously the picture of me in the middle <laughs> I think I had a bit of stick oh, me and Boydie said it last year to be fair I'm the only current player on the actual wall at, that's on view because I think Boydie's on the opposite side so uh, nah I think uh, I think they need to touch up and just give me a little bit of a beard just to make sure to be fair though, we needed a bit more room for Boydie yeah definitely I think he got the whole wall out the back no uh, no it's just a little bit of joke I had with a few of the boys last year so uh, even you think it looks like me now don't you I can't look at that any other way now <laughs> <laughs> Gary thanks very much and uh, all the best for Wednesday Cheers. we'll see you then thanks a lot Cheers.